Now, we are finishing with a, a biggie with Princess Cruises next. Just actually, just before we show you the, um, the destinations of the port. Yes. Uh, again, you've got some news with Planet Cruise and Princess, yes, haven't you, Gemma? we've just won another award. Another award. Another award. So Planet Cruise have been awarded um, the number one top UK guest. So that means that Planet Cruise have booked more passengers than any other travel agent. With Princess? With Princess, yeah, in the UK. Wow. In the UK. So they had a great, yeah, Planet Cruise had a great year. And this is why we get so many great prices. And remember, we are live every Tuesday at 8 and every uh, Friday at 11. Anyway, this... Uh, this is a trip of a lifetime, and it starts off, of course, with your flight over to Buenos Aires, and you're going to stay uh, in a wonderful hotel for two nights, that way. Yeah, you are, and as you say, great way to get this very wonderful big cruise started. A nice stay in Buenos Aires, which obviously is famous for all sorts of things, but we have also included in the price a lovely tango show and dinner. How fun would that be? I mean. You know, Argentina, famous yeah. for the tango. I'm sure a lot of you are Strictly Come Dancing fans. You can go and see the real thing. The I'd real that. tango. Wouldn't yeah, that be I really so would. amazing? I would absolutely dinner. love it as well. Yeah, over dinner. So that's included in your two-night stay. As you can see here, there's so much more to do and see as well for the rest of your time. Um, it's often referred to as the Paris of South America, Buenos Aires, and there is so much history to it. Um, and lots of different sort of sections of the city, so lots of districts. So you can go and see like La Boca district, for instance. So certain bits that are good for shopping certain bits that are good for architecture and food but there's lots of woods and parks and you've got to get surely an Argentine sort of steak that would probably be your dinner won't it yeah, yeah, I bet it will be. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, can yeah. you imagine? Yeah. Oh, Do you know? You make me feel really hungry. I know, again, I'm yeah. sorry. It's this awful diet thing. I can't be bothered with it. <laughs> um, so that's Buenos Aires. You're going to have an amazing time. And then, before that as well, on day four, what you're going to do is transfer from your hotel to the airport. And you are going to fly internally from Buenos Aires to Iguazu, which is also in Argentina. And there, you're going to transfer to a hotel for a two-night stay in Iguazu Falls. And again, Again, this is all included in the price. And you actually get a full day tour. And I was reading about this tour. It is spectacular, isn't oh, it? Oh, yeah. It's a full day excursion of the Argentinian side of the Iguazu Falls, where you'll see so much nature, um, because um, the other side is Brazil. Brazil. I'm right in saying that. From the notes I read, 275 waterfalls. Oh, just look at it. Yeah, yeah. It's absolutely stunning. That's right. And within your tour also, you'll be talking about, I mean, there's around this area, there's 450 species of birds, and the, the river plunges from a height of 80 I mean, metres. It's going to be absolutely amazing. And, and the most wonderful plants and birds. And oh, art. yeah. So that's all sorted for you. After your full day tour, you will then fly from the falls to Buenos Aires, and then you embark your ship for 14 so nights we've cruising. All, so we've already had an amazing time. Yeah. And your cruise hasn't even begun. Oh, yeah, you've already done uh, Buenos Aires. You've had your amazing tango night. Then you've gone to the falls. And now we're on the ship. And <laughs> this is, of course, with Princess Cruises. And you're going to be on board the Star Princess. And, you know, I was speaking... Uh, just to actually um, a viewer the other day who d had 12 cruises with Princess. Really? And never been disappointed. Well, uh, that says it all, doesn't it? Returning like that. And it is an absolutely beautiful ship comprising of 13 decks weighing 109,000 tonnes. And she really is like a place to visit just, you know, on her own. She's beautiful. Amazing food, as you can see. I mean, too many places to name. You've got your pizzeria and hamburger place, your steakhouse, your Italian, your, you know, international food court. The list goes on. The entertainment that you can see here. Princess, fantastic at entertainment. Um, the nightclub, the singers, the lounges, the movies under the stars. I mean, they do it so well. Anyone that ever thinks they could be bored on a cruise ship, you, you, it's impossible because there is, there's always so much to choose from, so much going on, and it's all included as well. Honestly, I'd be really bored in a hotel now compared to a cruise. <laughs> Anyway. Do you know what my mum would say? She'd say, if you're bored on a cruise ship, you're boring. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I think my mum would say I to like me. That. Yeah. Um, anyway, as well as having such a great time on the ship, look at the ports that we're visiting. And this is a real biggie, isn't it? Well, so. well that's right. And actually, so when you get on the ship, you are going to have um, a day in Buenos Aires. And then, where you've already been, and then you, on day eight, you sail to Montevideo in Uruguay, which is where we are now. Really wonderful place, slightly less cosmopolitan than some of the places, but just a huge range of possibilities for the day trippers, monuments, restaurants, beaches, art galore. Day nine, you're at sea, and then on day 10, uh, at this point now, what we're about to do is sail 
all the way around this bit of South America, starting in Puerto Madryn, we're going to get off here, uh, where you can do all sorts of things like whale watching and penguin tours. Oh. And actually, this is the part of the world you've got to see a few penguins. They're so sweet. So make sure you do that. And then day 11, you've got at sea. And day 12, you're going to sail to the Falkland Islands, which is obviously famous for historic reasons. And there is absolutely because museums there that you can go and visit. I, I, again, it's a place on my wish list. Well, it would be fascinating. Yeah. I think you'd learn a lot more actually being there and you know feeling what it's like to be there. And then day 13, you're going to be sailing around Cape Horn, which is something that intrepid sailors always wanted yeah. to, to do back in the day when they didn't have big cruise ships amazing cruising incredible scenery and you can say you've done it ticket off your bucket list day 14 you're going to be in Ushuaia which is the southernmost city in the world and the city closest to Antarctica so you'll see from here the Andes mountains in the background um, you've got lakes and bays and forests and glaciers really beautiful Day 15, then you're going to be in Punta Arenas in Chile. So this is, look at all these different ports of call. You are really doing a very extensive uh, itinerary in this part of the world. You'll feel like you're in the middle of nowhere here, because you are. But that's a really amazing experience. Um, looking out over the Straits of Magellan, you've got these windswept shores and fjords and the frozen mass of Antarctica and more penguins. I like those ones. Um, day 16, you're going to be sailing into the Amalia Glacier, which is a southern Patagonian ice field, which used to cover the entirety of southern Chile just 10,000 years ago. Um, so again, more beautiful incredible scenery that you might otherwise never experience in your whole life. And, and don't forget, this one is for 2016, so yeah. only a deposit needed tonight to secure your place in this one. Yeah, and so much time to look forward to it and plan and get excited and look at this. And then day 18, um, you're going to be in Puerto Montt in Chile, which the port is sort of tucked into a V-shaped slit along the side of the mountain, so it's not very big, and when you arrive from the ship, You'll be like, wow, where am I? Because you'll see signs in Spanish, um, because it was also populated by Spaniards and Germans at one point. So you've got a real mixture. Um, amazing countryside again. You can go and have a picnic. If you're a real outdoorsy type, you can do things like fly fishing. You can go hiking. Uh, you could do zip lining. I've done that I've once. done that, yes. Yeah, that's fun. And, um, so, and, yeah. And then a, a final day at sea, and then you disembark in Santiago. But yeah. you actually get an extra two nights here in yeah. a Hampit Hotel, don't you? Yes, so as if that isn't enough, and if you think of all the experiences you've had, you've got a two-night stay, as you say, in a nice hotel in Santiago. And again, this is this incredible city in Chile, and yet in the background, and I think the next picture will really show this, you've got these amazing I mountains, know. Jasper, which um, is the Andes. And we do get uh, a city tour included as well here, don't we? Yes, you do. That is included in the price as well. Again, arranged by Planet Cruise. So a whole city tour. So that's going to um, be really fascinating. By the way, this is a brand new exclusive package for Planet Cruise that we've launched right now. Um, amazing, that one. And don't forget, you're going to be aboard this stunning ship with Princess Cruises, the Star Princess. That really is a trip of lifetime, Gemma, isn't it? That, that is an amazing one. I would love to go on that one but because I think it's so extensive and you can really feel like you've done that part of the world, but uh, you've done it in comfort and style. And again, if you've got any questions, any queries, if that's sort of taking your fancy but you've, you know, not sure for whatever reason, give us a call on that free phone number, which is uh, 0800 840 10 Let's just have a recap, because uh, there was a lot in that one, wasn't there? There was yeah. a lot, yeah, really, really <laughs> extensive. And again, I always feel like we're saying so much information, so please pick up the phone if you want to know anything. But uh, that is new and exclusive to, of course, Planet Cruise. Uh, your term flights are included there, but we can, and they're based on London, but we can provide flights from most UK airports, and all of those are... Uh, Hotel stays are included in that price, of course, as well. So if you'd like to, say, book that one or just got any queries, give us a call 0800 840 1088. And that's three weeks, you know, know, with tours, with flights, you know, obviously your accommodation and, and all, all the food. And, oh, it's amazing. Um, I tell you what, I do, as I say, I do need to take this year off. We both do, Jim, yeah, and we do, do all these cruises. 